turned up to this one Worcester Bosch 30 SI heat exchanger looks a bit sorry for itself just wanted to put a quick video together to help people understand whether it's a split heat exchanger or a burner gasket that's gone so you can see all this crusting around the seam around the top this means the heat exchanger split you can also see at the bottom as well it's probably been ran with low pressure and poor system water for a long time let's take a closer look we'll whip this out this will give us a bit more room so you can see all that crusting i mean it's pretty bad when it's split the heat exchanger the waterways they weep so it weeps and dries weeps and dries because it's so hot which creates all that so with the clamp lifted out of the way now you can actually see that all that is nowhere near the burner gasket and also the only way you can tell if a burner gasket's gone is with an analyzer and if it's given out co in extreme cases you can see scorch marks at the side of the case or the electrodes and flame rectification will be all brittle that's an indication but you'll never be able to see visual signs like this every time you come to a heat exchanger and you see this it's the heat exchanger that's gone if the boiler's under 10 years old you can ring Worcester Bosch and they will actually send you out a heat exchanger free of charge but obviously you'll have to fit it but that's a little bit of info that might save the customer a couple of hundred quid you can see a new one compared with the old one I mean look at the state of that but I'll put a new burner gasket on and that's where it sits and hopefully that will help you see that it's not the burner gasket as the corrosion is nowhere near it so next time you see a heat exchanger like that a burner gasket won't save you happy days